Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Today is not an April Fool's um, video, just so you guys know. Um, but anyways, guys, my name is Clayton, aka Gold Bear from the channel. And today, guys, we're basically just going to be talking about some FNAF stuff. Yeah, this month is going to be crazy because I'm planning on getting a whole bunch of FNAF merchandise. Um, I can't wait. Because if you guys don't know, yeah, I'm pretty sure a lot of you do. Funko is re-releasing all of their um, FNAF Wave 1 uh, merchandise. So that means we're going to begin the action figures that we can't find anymore. Actually, I have pictures that I'm probably going to put up at the end of the video of showing you guys what the new packaging looks like. It's not too different, but it is a little different. There's going to be like one picture. Um, but anyways, we're going to be getting the action figures back. We're going to be getting the plushies. We're going to be getting the vinyl packs. We're going to be getting everything that we can't find in stores for FNAF all back. Um, I'm taking it. You can probably find these at Walmart, Target, GameStop. Um, maybe hot topic, but that's for that's all I really know for now. Um, there has been two leaked action figures. I'm not sure if they're really real, but from the picture, they kind of look like they're Funko, like made by Funko. But I'm not really sure. And these figures are Dread Bear and Grim Foxy. Now these could I. I have pictures, I might put those at the end as well, but um, I'm not sure if they're real or not, so don't I, don't I don't want you guys to start being, oh guys, look what's coming out, because I don't know if these are official or if they're fake or whatever, because, you know, you can go up to your friend and be like, hey, look what's go coming out, and then they'll be so excited, and then next minute you'll be like, oh wait, no they're not, and then you basically <laughs> just ruin the kid's dream. <laughs> Anywho, yeah, so I don't know if they're real. My friends, my friend told me that they're supposedly edited, or he thinks they're at least edited. I'm, I'm kind of on the fence with it. They, they're, they look like they're edited, but at the same time, they kind of look like they're quality Funko merchandise, so I don't know. Anyways, like I said, you guys, you guys won't be able to really find maybe these plushies. But I know for a fact that um, the Wave 1 plushies are coming back. I'm not sure if Nightmare Freddy was a part of Wave 1. I think he was a part of Wave like 2 or 3. I'm not sure. You guys won't be able to find these yet. I'm not sure if they're going to be re-releasing the Sister Location and all the other plushies. But I know that they're going to be re-releasing all the plushies from FNAF 1. So, or at least the Wave 1 plushies. So yeah. And if you guys look closely in the video at the end, if you do watch to the end with the uh, pictures I put up there, you can take a close look. If you have a Foxy already, you can take a close look at this right now or something. But this is not this is not a um, re-released action figure. I actually got this uh, like a year ago. Actually, kind of weird because I was I was at Walmart and they had a whole bunch of these figures on the shelf and I'm just like, how did they get these in? I thought these I thought they stopped making the FNAF wave or wave one. And um, you can see how the color color shade of him is a little dirty red, but with these new figures, I think they're made they painted them completely different, so now they have more of a brighter color to them, so they look more little more better than the old ones now I'm not sure if the joints are gonna be different I'm hoping they're not because if they are then that means I'm gonna have to get fo another foxy which I already have them so I'm hoping that the joints aren't too different but um, I'm hoping they just fit the same so I don't have to re get another foxy because I already have spring trap and then they'll just be a mess so and less money dropping down the drain because you know, I'm thinking about getting some of the plushies as well, so, you know, it, I don't think that, I don't think the joints are going to be different, they did say that they are working on the joints, so they're going to make them look, they're going to make them so they're not all rusty and stuff, kind of, not, maybe not rusty, that's probably not the right term to put it, but they're going to make it so it's not hard or 
too soft to like if you're walking him across the hallway or something he, his arm doesn't just break or if you're trying to pose him his arm doesn't break off they're not gonna make it like that they're they're gonna make them they're gonna make them with better articulation hopefully so um expect those in the next maybe a week or two um i'm actually gonna try to go out to walmart this week and see if i can find a couple of them i'm hoping they have golden freddy because golden freddy is one of my favorite characters from five nights at freddy's and i kind of want him in my collection so i'm gonna try to get him i i'm gonna try to do a little i'm gonna do a little uh deal with my mom and dad and see if i can get two action figures but they're probably only gonna let me get one so i'm not sure but uh, anyways guys, thanks for watching this video, uh, take a look at a couple of the couple pictures I put at the end here, and um, I'll see you guys in the next Five Nights at Freddy's video, whenever that is. Um, also, the, la the Last of Us, um, I'm doing a series on that now, so you guys can go check out my playlist, there's only one video. Um, I'm not going to really do any talking on it because it's more of a story based video so you know there's more talking into it so I'm just going to let you guys hear the audio. I am recommending that you guys should be 16 or older watching it because there's a lot of cuss words and everything in it and stuff like that and there's a lot of kind of gore in it as well so just, just saying, just, just saying. Anyways guys thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.